Hello my soccer universe. I think it is time that we take out the last jersey from the parcel that Andy sent me. By the, by the way, I've uh, read a little bit now, meanwhile, through the uh, magazines that he sent me. This one is a really engaging read on current, um, uh, on current um, jerseys. There is of course classic football shirts, always has good stuff in there. So really really enjoyed these magazines thank you so much andy for sending these along okay now uh you already see one jersey that was up in this package which was this uh wonderful rangers jersey that now pays of course dividend yes i'm sure it's after rangers uh, made it to the semifinals to the europa league so i'm very very happy i was so happy that it was rangers and not braga because i don't need to get a braga jersey uh which would have been yeah well um, their jersey was on sale at the time that I looked, but it would not have been cheap because of the shipping. Also, uh, the other two, as I said, were, so he found this one for me from an online seller. The other two were from um, Vintage uh, Football uh, store uh, shirts, Vintage Football shirts, that's the store, uh, where the first one that I unpacked was, of course, the Herrenvein uh, jersey that I really like. Uh, but the real reason why I ordered from them is this very shirt here, which is a shirt that ever since I saw it at the beginning of the 1819 season that I really wanted to have. I really wanted to have, but I didn't want to pay full price for it. And uh, it has been on the vintage football shirts for quite a while for relatively reasonable uh, i think it was around 30 35 pounds and they had the sponsor less and the sponsor and the sponsored version and i have to say uh while i know it was mostly worn with sponsors i have to say this jersey looks really really much better without the sponsor and that's why I went for it. I am talking, of course, about, and if you know the story, you probably already know which jersey I'm talking about. Give you a little preview. It's funnily enough from a team that I don't support all that much. It's an Italian team that was in the Europa League, so the uh, background is, of course, proper. We're talking. The Eagle Shirt of Lazio from the 1819 season. I have to say, the moment I saw this, I knew this is one uh, that I need to get. And I know, I, I think in two years after, I think after, this was well in 1819, I think in 1920 I saw it was still sold, but it was never really cheap. Then uh, I saw it on eBay once where I was bidding for it, but I was not 100% uh, if it's authentic or not. And then there were a lot of uh, fees coming, coming with it, so in end. I decided not to go for it and then I saw it uh, on vintage football shirts and boy. This is a gorgeous Lazio shirt and I actually like it because I have a home home shirt that's a traditional light blue but I really like it. This is this 80s inspired rebrand where you have actually this uh, eagle pattern and it goes on to, 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 to the sleeves. Um, and there's only a little bit of the uh, light blue so it actually makes for kind of it's I could use it as an away jersey in my background if I wanted to ha uh, to, to, to do so. It's all about that eagle pattern. And that the normal Lazio crest is on there is, I think, an additional bonus. I even like the color. This is, I know this is the last season that Macron had this uh, a word mark logo. And I know there's this long standing debate between me and Idris, uh, who says that the new uh, one is better. And I see his point. It never bothered me, but I have had to say, as soon as they came out with, with, with a new logo, I have to say the overall shirt designs, not that it took a, took a plunge, but I think up up until that, that, that point, almost anything that Macron produced, I really, really liked for about four or five CC seasons, with that being the crowning achievement. What I also like is that the Macron logo here is in white. That is great branding, because it doesn't destroy the shirt in any way. What can I say? An absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous shirt. I have ha have it of Corcoros Black. I really like the numbering style. It was the classic 3D lettering. Um, that yeah, is not. Uh, uh, it was really nice, but you know, I I'm quite happy to have it as a blanket. Also says SS Lazio, 1900, which is the year of their founding. 
and then some uh, something in Italian that I don't really understand, but it's always nice to have this Macron sticker there. So yeah, I think club shirt wise, this was the best shirt in 1819. There is no question in my mind about that. So yeah, uh, what do you think about this one? Do you, do you think there was a was a better better one this year? Club shirt. I think the, uh, the, they were very nice uh, in, in 2018. Of course, the Nigeria shirt and, and, and so on. But club shirt wise, this was my favorite. Any case, let me know what you think about this jersey. I think they even... Did they win the Coppa Italia in this one? This could be an, an, an additional uh, uh, point uh, plus for uh, this jersey. In any case, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like these. I will talk to you soon. Bye. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day.